But first at 11 o'clock, breaking news. We are hearing exclusively from New York Mayor Adams after he was served a new subpoena in a federal corruption investigation. Eyewitness News reporter Josh Eidegger is in the newsroom with the mayor's reaction. Josh? The shot of the news broke tonight, but subpoenas to Mayor Adams and some on his campaign staff actually were served several weeks ago. The mayor reacting this evening in an interview with Bill for this weekend's edition of Eyewitness News Up Close. The investigation's been going on almost as long as he's been mayor. Eric Adams and his campaign now facing a new round of subpoenas, sources say, seeking communications and documents. Though in an Eyewitness News exclusive tonight, Adams wasn't exactly forthcoming about what specifically the feds are after. What did you get subpoenaed for and what's the status of the investigation? You know, like previous administrations that had to go through subpoenas, you, you participate, you cooperate. Uh, I made it clear, former law enforcement officer, I've stated over and over again, uh, I, I hold myself beyond rep a, a reproach, and y when you receive a subpoena, you respond. The mayor has not been accused of any crime, but the new developments reported first tonight by the New York Times come after a long-running corruption investigation into his 2021 campaign, and, at least in part, involves whether Adams or the campaign sought illegal contributions from the government of Turkey in exchange for pressuring the fire department to rush the inspection of a new Turkish consulate. Last November, the FBI served several search warrants, including at the Brooklyn home of Adams fundraiser Brianna Suggs, and agents also approached the mayor himself on the street, seizing his electronic devices. It's unclear what prompted the new subpoenas, which were actually served last month. But tonight, an Adams attorney repeated the mayor had done nothing wrong. Our investigation, he said, has included an evaluation of campaign documents, an analysis of tens of thousands of electronic communications and witness interviews. To be clear, we have not identified any evidence of illegal conduct by the mayor. To the contrary, we've identified extensive evidence undermining the reported theories of federal prosecution as to the mayor, which we have voluntarily shared with the U.S. attorney. And both the mayor and his attorney continue to say they are volunteering to assist the U.S. attorney and cooperate with anything that's requested. That while they have not said what has been requested. Cannot stress enough, though, the mayor has not been accused of any wrongdoing, much less a crime. But this investigation does continue tonight. Bill? Clearly. All right, Josh, thank you. The mayor talking about the subpoena and the upcoming Democratic convention where he's a delegate starting Monday. You can see the rest of my interview with the mayor this Sunday on Up Close at 11 a.m.